Hi, I'm Feli of Notorious Funk, and this is the lesson number three and a half, <laughs> four, of my rendition of the Rain Song, and this lesson is not easy, and the reason is that there are a um, long section of bar records, okay, and then you have stretching while you're playing the bar, so it's not easy. Uh, so I will probably make some buzz here and there. I'm human, <laughs> okay, even because I have the 13 here, and, uh, and when I recorded the... My cover, they were 12. Okay, that's more soft. Anyway, uh, uh, if you're going to learn something, as I say, or if you like the video, please uh, thumb up and subscribe. I very much appreciate it. With that said, uh, I will play first very slow, uh, with some buds, probably. <laughs> and then, uh, because I'm human, and then, and then we talk. Okay, let's go. to play <laughs> and it wasn't even that slow anyway um <clears throat> about the fingering you have everything written in the box somewhere here okay so you say from this guy here <laughs> i'm sorry i'm dyslexic and something else i don't know so anyway <clears throat> we are in um, uh, four position and the second uh, finger is on the fifth string again check the fingering uh, it's accurate and uh, we play this, start to play this with um, um, thumb. So it's thumb, thumb on the fifth and the fourth, and then index on the on the third, and then thumb on the fourth. So thumb, thumb, index, thumb. Okay, and then you have this Amaron pull off on the first string with the third finger, and then this is thumb, thumb. Uh, tom tom <laughs> on the um, fourth string. So all together, slow as this. And then we move to the uh, to this part, which is tough. Okay, and the reason is that you have this um, stretching, which seems nothing, but it's difficult. Okay. Because it takes energy to the first finger, okay? You can take this straight. And so, even because this string are 13, not 12, I, and the video I recorded with the entire barre. But that was because the string were soft than this. Uh, so I can play this on with, with the entire barre. Even use this, again, this technique of barre, which is what I use, okay? It's the better, it's the best. Technique, okay, my opinion, of course, and uh, which is to use the weight of the of your entire arm in, instead of uh, pushing the thumb against the index. Okay, so uh, you have a lesson if you want to 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 check this um, technique <clears throat> that I recorded, which is here. So I can do this. I like it, and but just very quickly is this movement so use the entire arm the entire weight of your arm uh, to push against the string so the index does nothing and the thumb almost nothing this is okay just very very quickly and so to do this i use um, a little barrier and not the entire barrier because this is more efficient even because less is more okay somebody say uh, more is more. <laughs> He's a great guitarist, okay, by the way. Uh, I won't say his name. You, you can say his name if you know it. 
uh, let me know if you know who is this guy and but in my opinion less is more and no more and more anyway uh this is a uh, little bit in, in second position and then we have this which is thumb index middle ring all together so you have to think of this in one movement movement because it's a fast arpeggio so bram okay and then this oh sorry this is weird okay and it's hard to play because you have to use the pinky in this position going uh, almost up the third finger it's on the same fret but there's not another way to play this voicing so you have to do this <laughs> okay so is this and then thumb on the first string uh, with a pinky on the on the sixth fret and then just the barre and then the middle and then again uh, this uh, one two uh, one pinky let me see yes this is hard okay um, take it easy um, slow everything down and push okay with your arm and do not do this otherwise I don't know if you can play make a cross but I don't believe <laughs> I don't think so so very slow oh and when you play the pinky this is quite difficult even uh, you have to not stop this so every every note have to be clean and clear and that's why it's not easy From here, we turn back to this. Uh, let me see. Okay. Yes. So now you can do the entire barre or keep in or keep this if you want. That's not different. Um, probably would be better if you keep the same, so you don't have to move. Uh, making other movements that are not required. Okay, so the, the, the guitar is an economy instrument, my opinion, of course. So that's why I say less is more. Um, so if you're, if you're using this and then you have to move to this, there's no reason to do this, okay? Um, otherwise, it's better for you, okay? We are, we are all different, but basically it's better to do this. <laughs> Then it's the same part. Uh, so I'm around, pull off again. Now we move to this, which is the same as this one, but we are playing this in uh, seven position, in fifth position. No, it's, yes, because it's the index. Give me the position, so in fifth position. Mm. And Please do not move the barre because you are going to use this again. So it's just a moment that you can breathe. Okay, I don't have to push. So from here, um, this is the entire, um, this is the fifth string and then the third, the second, and the first with the thumb, index, middle, and ring all together. One movement, okay, blam, it's the same of, the, of this. So here, and this is pinky uh, on ninth fret, and then uh, it's just the barrette, so it's, uh, yeah, you're using, you are in fifth position. Here you can breathe and and I do not uh, I not use the barrette, so very slow. See. I'm not using this, just this note. And from here, we move back to two fret in, say, in seven position. Doing this, so it's pinky, uh, pinky, and middle, and the barrette. If you want, you can do um, Ameron. And then this chord again. Which is exactly the same of the first uh, 
course, when, when, when start this um, bar record progression. So again, this very slow, all together, pinky uh, index, pinky again on the third string in ninth position, and now we shift. This again is all together, and then this is uh, six on on the third on the fourth string and on the sixth fret. Check the box. <laughs> See, I can make mistakes. So, so this six uh, two because of the barrel, uh, and then the middle. score you do string no, so this is it's hard to play so is the yeah, I'm using the same technique as um, as the the, the, uh, the the second chord which was this you remember it's the same so if you watch me and I, I leave the guitar going this way so remember to push and to compensate with your with the other arm um, really, there's not another way to to. Uh, let me check if it's recorded because sometimes it's stopped. No, and it's it's hard. It's tough. Okay, it's not easy. I'm not saying it's easy to play by record. Uh, okay, yeah, this one is easy. No, I don't. It doesn't play as a major chord because of the tuning. But but when you start to stretch, uh, that's when things become more difficult. Okay. So playing with 12 is better. <laughs> I have 13, I'm sorry now. Uh, so again, this is all together, then six, two, and then four uh, with the middle. Again, all together, and then thumb, 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 which is five, four, two, and all the string. We're up here, we can breathe and we are safe now because this was the, really, it's, it's the harder part for me to play in this song. Um, and I'm good with barrel, but you know, playing with the acoustic, with iron string, uh, and, and on the acoustic, it's, it's tough, okay? I understand this. On the classic, it's a little bit, it's different. It's not, it's not easier, but it's, it's on acoustic for me it's tough, uh, it's, it's harder. So we are right here and this is just the string of a string uh, and then we have this with the index in second position. I'm gonna off really quickly. And this is uh, it's just a string, so it's uh, B, G and this string. Index. I'm around pull off. Just the string, and then we go to doing this harmonics, which is repeating. So you start. You can play from the fifth to the first string, and then again I'm around pull off. But this time we are uh, on the 14th fret. So 14, 12. I'm in on prof, and then just the string. Oh, but I use this, so I cross with the other finger to keep the, to keep the, the the notes playing. Okay, because I want to uh, to 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 last the more I can. So, and then I, I slide to the second. Sorry. So this. Which is easy. It's just the. Um, uh, it's like a major chord, but it's not because of the tuning. So this is very quiet. Okay. 
Okay, I don't talk too much about dynamics because I don't want the video to be too much long. Okay, right? because I make a video of 20 minutes, 15 minutes in this tutorial and, and people can keep the attention for too many minutes. <laughs> I'm trying to remain short, the more short I can. So anyway, so, uh, but let me know if you appreciate uh, the first tutorial because I, in this, on that one, I went in depth uh, on dynamics and expression. So anyway, let me know. Um, this is just down, down, down as one or up, down. What it's important that you um, return with an up when you are on this, okay? Because if you play this with a down, it's different. Then I don't like your eye, okay? Then if you want, do what you want. So down, 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 and this is, I use the pinky because I'm trying to uh, not play with the sixth, with the sixth string because that would be too much, okay? So. Then is the verse three, probably is the verse three. Up, up, down. Oh, sorry. Yes, is this. Up, up. I do like not all the string, but like three. So the first time, all the strings. Oh, sorry for the sound, but I broke my uh, fingernails. Yes. So, up, up, all, not all the, all the string, and then uh, really quickly I have to go down with the thumb just on the fifth string, so up, so up, up, this is easy, but, but what is difficult is to um, hit the fifth string after this because you have to change the position on this, at least for me. So, up, sorry. And this is two, four on the fifth string. I use the index, okay? And then, same chord but on sixth position. And same thing. Uh, so let me check because if I play things so slow, I don't remember this, the thing, the, the notes. Yes, another uh, up, and even this time, not all the strings. So the first one, you play all the strings, and then the second, I probably play three string, two string. Doesn't I, I don't care. I just try to make this uh, change. So. Up, a slide in nine position on the fifth string and so it's nine seven nine and then just the, the fifth string uh, but to be sure you have to check this <laughs> box <laughs> okay <laughs> because I could play one note more or one note less of, of the bass. Let me try. Pam, pam, pam. Yes, three. So this is like uh, verse one is all verse two. Uh, it's the same. What, what changed here was this. Voice here. I don't remember if it's on the record or if I had by myself, probably it was on the record. And these two. What I like the, after this is to go quiet and then just a little uh, talk a little bit of dynamics here because this is full range of dynamics. A nice contrast so I like to do this in this way then of course you can do what you want then so we are here in fifth position and, and you have the you know, I'm using the third the second and the four in on the four third and second string but 
you have the box and here is the melody okay so we want this this <coughs> to be marked sorry this all plucked together so here I do up 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 down 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 okay then do what you want so this uh, here remembered the melody yeah? when you arrive here which is uh, I'm really like it you're like it's like doing a B major B flat B flat so it's not A major but it's this and it's like but it's not okay, because of the tune of the guitar so I play just the of the string then I'm around pull off and then I have this I added this uh, two little harmonics, artificial harmonics. So I, I'm in fifth position. I have to go with the index. Okay, there are uh, different ways to play harmonics. In this case, I, I use the thumb under underneath my index, and the index goes just up the fret. Mm. And so it's it's uh, four. I'm talking about string, okay? On the four, on the third string, and then four back and back to the four again. So, um, so string, then I'm around, and then uh, third, uh, sorry, four, third, four, but it's written there, okay? So, uh, and from here. Probably, let me check if it's this. Yes, um, then this is the same as before, so it doesn't change a, a lot. And then it goes to this part here. Sorry. And this part is the same as the lesson number one or two, I don't remember. It's, it's, it's the same, completely the same, except the, the last chord where I use a rasgueado. If you want, you can do it, otherwise uh, you can just play up, down. It would be easy and we, uh, let me check if it's recording. Yes, it is. You can do just up, down. So... This is, uh, in this case, on the recording, on, on my core, I use this, but I can use my pinky, as you know, and if you don't know, I tell you, it's broken. So I use this, which is, oh, it's very unclean, now I like it, uh, which is index, middle, uh, ring, and thumb. Okay, bram bam, and then a down uh, or not. Now, and then this. Uh, I'm on eighth position on the G string, and then ten, probably, yes, it would be ten, and then twelve. So, eight, ten, twelve. You can play this. As you want, I use apoyado or apoyato. Uh, as you want, you can play with the thumb if you want. It doesn't make a big change. And after this, uh, we go to this again. This time without the uh, um, rasgado. Oh, this was um, this shape of chord here. Uh, which is like a, a seven, but it's not. So we are in uh, uh, eleven position, probably. Yes, and I'm using the third on the first string and the pinky on the uh, B string, and this move up and down. So it's eleven, nine, twelve, eleven, four, and then go back to nine. But this time with the middle on eight on the uh, fifth string so so it's very slow as this up down or the accent is on the up okay up bit it is very soft then if you want okay 
it's really up to you. And from this part, we move to, which is on lesson number five or four and a half. Okay, I'll quit now to make this joke because it's too much, but it's funny for me. And so remember to push with your arm to make, to make a clean barrette right? because this is stronger again than, uh, sorry, this is stronger than this. If you have big hands as Stereo Vogan or, or Segovia, <laughs> but even Segovia was at this, so sometimes, not all the time. So this work and um, remember to <laughs> this is the tough part and the, the hardest part of of, uh, of 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 this tutorial. <laughs> of this this is really unnatural okay but if you want to play this uh, voicing there's no other way to finger in this uh, or maybe you can go up but <laughs> I wouldn't do that if, if I was you anyway so remember to push and then basically it's not too difficult and this um, sorry really is this rasgados is more difficult than, than as it looks so you can do it in so many ways so if you can do it like this pam 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 as really as it's really up to you even one finger if you want <laughs> okay or just do this and here just a second it would be better to use um i see this only now, so I would say this while I'm recording. To have this free, because we use this fingering, it would be better to do this. So that we can have this too free now. Then, of course, here we change. And the reason is because if you play this, and then you have to play this, you have to be very quickly. So to be more safe, um, sorry, yeah, that would that would work. See, um, if you play things slow, if you uh, try to to see things from d different angles. Uh, you can change the fingers and find other solutions and which I always say to my students do that okay fingering is not always is not um, uh, something that is fixed always are the same now uh, because we are all different hands and my hands for example are not big but are longer okay and I can play as for example um, a chacon with the, with the finger of uh, of Segovia <laughs> that doesn't, doesn't work for me that's for me, okay. Anyway, this that's this, that's it for lesson number um, number four. I will make the joke now and see you on lesson number five. <laughs> Ciao.